I promise. Uh -oh. <laughs> <laughs> What's been the growth of this offense from day one till now for you guys? I mean, we've had a lot of growth so far. I mean, when you come into spring not knowing an offense, just trying to figure things out, and, you know, it just really takes a lot of reps. And um, you know, I think we've just grown a lot cl closer as a group over the over the spring, and, yeah, we've came a long way. How much of a difference for you as a center are your calls with this new staff, or is it pretty, you know, pretty hanky? I mean, they're pretty much interchangeable. I mean, it's pretty much basic zone schemes, gap schemes, um, you know, nothing nothing too different. You just got to work through, um, you know, different line calls and you know, different protection calls and things like that, but it hasn't been too much of a struggle. Which teams won in the spring game? Uh, Team Brave, sure. Have you seen any separation with, with the quarterbacks at all? You work with all three of them, I assume. So have you seen any separation now that we're coming to the end of spring here? I mean, all quarterbacks are doing a great job. I'm not going to I'm not gonna sit up here and <laughs> try to make a controversy. But um, they all bring different things to the table. Um, you know, I think they've all, all done a great job, though, so far this spring. What about as the line as a whole? Is there a group of five that's really gelling right now together or just ten feet? <laughs> I mean, yeah, we're we're definitely really deep. Um, you know, the five five of us that have been starting so far this spring, um, we've been gelling really well. But I mean, obviously, uh, it's it's going to shake up a little bit come fall with you know Tyrell coming back and some of the incoming guys that we got. I and mean, we're going to be really deep. Um, you know, there's going to be guys fighting all over the place for spots, and you know, we'll see what happens. You guys are all separated from the spring game. Does that make it difficult at all? If the, the five of you've been working together, that gets separated now, or or how's that kind of work in the spring game? I guess it makes things a little different, but. Um, yeah, I guess you do get more comfortable uh, playing with a certain guy next to you for the whole spring. But you know, it just you just got to make sure that you're locked in with communication so that everybody knows what what everybody else is doing and there's no gray areas. So it really just comes down to communication. We don't get to go talk to Jordan Scott, and you go up against him quite a bit. What have you seen from him, and what makes him so impressive early on this spring camp? Well, I mean, just his size and athleticism are a huge upside. I mean, being you know being 330, 35 pounds or whatever he's down to now. Um, and being you know six one, he has he plays with great pad level, and he's just a load. I mean, it's, he's really hard to move. Um, you know, I love going against him in practice because he makes me a better player, forces me to play with power and great pad level. Because if I don't, he can't move the dude because he's huge. Um, but you know, he definitely has a great upside um, with his size and athleticism, and you know, he's going to be a key contributor for us this year. And he has potential to be a really great player for us in the future. Not to put down any of your other teammates, but over the last two years for you, is that one of the hardest guys to go against in practice for you? <laughs> he's, he's big. The dude is hard to move, that's for sure. Thanks, Jake.